Hi, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna change this lever here out. We're gonna put on one of our black ones. For this customer, he just wants this lever powder coated flat black. So we have the different style, the gunner style with the holes in it. But I'll show you how easy this is to do. Nothing fancy, nothing falls apart. It takes two minutes to do. There's a top bolt right here. Now either you can't put a wrench on it. Underneath here, if you look under here, there's a nut. It's a 10 millimeter nut. So all you do is just put your socket on there take that nut out, nothing's going to fall off, you just take that nut off and now if you look on the top, the bolt, you just pop that bolt out with your finger, push it from the bottom, that'll come right out. Just pull that bolt out. Now the lever's loose. There's, there's nothing connected to it. It's basically loose. What the problem is, is the clutch cable in here. So you're really not strong enough to pull that to disengage that. It's, it's pretty hard to pull that out. So a tip I give you is if you reach down on your clutch arm, down on the back of the motor, if you just reach on this and you can turn that, you can do that by hand. So what you're going to do is you're going to pull that like the clutch is on and then up here you're going to just pull that lever out and you'll see it come right out just like that real easy so what you do is then you just kind of there's a slot in here just kind of swivel the cable over and pull that right off it's that easy and you'll see a lot of grease on a lot of these so when you put this back together you want to clean that up if there's any dirt dust gravel stuff in there clean that up re-grease it now the one other thing is in this clutch lever, there's a bushing in here. You want to make sure you don't lose that bushing. Just pull it out. Some of them are stuck in there. That one came out real easy. So make sure you pull that out um, before you send us in the lever to get powder coated or if we send you out a set, make sure that's in there. So it's as easy as that. So in a second, we'll show you how to put it back together. So here's the lever we're going to put on. This is our Gunner Series levers. It's got the, the contrast cut holes in them. We can do levers flat black. We can do them all different ways. So the one thing you want to do is this that bushing. I just take a little bit of like white grease, put it in there, and take that bushing and just put it back in. It'll just kind of press right in, nothing hard. So you want to do that. The other thing you're going to want to do is up here on this cable, you want to lubricate that. Like I said, clean it off. Just take some like wheel bearing grease and just kind of smear it on there. Now when you put the lever back on, you're going to do the same thing. You're just going to kind of hook it on there and, and swivel it real easy. Now it's going to be the same thing. You won't be able to get it back in there. So what you have to do is you have to grab your clutch arm cover and then if you just stay up here and watch, you can see that move. Just grab your clutch arm cover. and then it'll go right in. You just pop it right in. Wipe off the extra grease. I put a little smear of that white grease. You can use regular grease. I just have this white grease here. Get your bolt hole line back up push that down in. We're going to just put that nut back on. This job should really take you um, literally only a minute to do this. Make sure when you're tightening this up the top of the bolt doesn't spin. You have to kind of get your finger on it and it kind of has a catch where it goes down in. That's all there is to it. Everything works, makes a beautiful lever, really tricks out your bike nice. Thanks for watching Witch Doctors.